Welcome to Graph Tutorials, I'm Shiva and in this short tutorial we will have a look at a different view modes in Adobe Illustrator. So preview and view modes in Adobe Illustrator. I have three shapes here to be able to show some kind of things to you. Um, let's first talk about the outline mode. Now the outline mode is especially helpful when you're working with shapes like this. Uh, it allows you to see whether the lines or the objects are intersecting. Um, so it's useful for shapes and objects. There are no colors and no images. Now how can you see the outline mode? You can go to view and there you can choose outline. And as you can see, no colors or whatever, it's just shapes, just lines, and that's it. The command for the outline mode and how you can get out of it is Control or Command Y. So if you press that, you get back to the normal view. Another way you can trigger the outline view is by Control or Command clicking on this eye icon in front of, the, of your layer, and then you also get into the outline mode. So really helpful tool to see the lines and the outlines of your project. The next preview, preview or view mode is the overprint preview. And the overprint preview is helpful for when you're sending your artwork to print, then you can preview how the colors, uh, shadows and other effects will look. And you can view that one in the same window view and then you go to overprint preview and as you can see here it shows you how it will look when you send it to have it print out um, so printing a digital design the digital design looks different than the printed design uh, can look different especially the colors and by previewing it in this mode you can adjust settings and colors so your design is as you want it to be. And then same option view, overprint preview, click it again and then you have your normal view. Now for the third view, this is the pixel preview. Um, the pixel preview you can use when you want to see how your design will look in the web browser. It allows you to see how the different, ob different objects will look when it's rasterized. Um, same steps, go to view and then choose pixel preview. And here you can zoom in to see each individual, individual pixel. Oh, I'm zooming too quickly. But you can zoom in here to check how everything will look. And then just move it again, go back to view and click the pixel preview again. And now you're back in your normal view. And then last but not least, we have the trim view. Um, the trim view is, yeah, is a view when you only want to see the artwork, which is in your art bar. So as you can see now, these objects, they go beyond my art bar. And when you then choose view, trim view, now you see only what's visible inside of your art bar. Um, and the trim view, you can also choose with the preview um, modes above it. So you can say pixel preview um, while in the trim preview or you can say overprint preview um, so that's also possible just click all the views you want to have if that's necessary for the project you're working on so all the different view modes in illustrator help you to catch and see and fix problems early on in your design um, so it's a, an extra step you can do before turning in your creative work to whoever you're turning it into to show it in its maximum value. So catch problems early on before turning in your artwork. So that was it for this 
short tutorial, just nice and easy, different preview modes in Illustrator and how you can view them. Let me know in the comments below if you liked it, if you have any questions, feel free to ask them also. If you liked it, be sure to press the thumbs up button and maybe if you want to see more, also click the subscribe button with the little bell icon. And I hope to see you in the next one.